and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube who's watching this video later on for some rotation proof Chandra Tribal. Uh, this has been a, a highly um, anticipated deck. A lot of people have been asking about this one. And honestly, I'm pretty excited to play it myself. Um, this looks pretty good. We're not really losing too much from like the normal Chandra Tribal deck that I was playing. Basically just Goblin Chain Whirler uh, in the main deck. And then sideboard cards like Blood Sun. That's, Blood Sun's really going to hurt not having access to. But besides that, I really like what we got going on here. You know, we still have all of our Chandras. We got the Regulator. We have good removal, um, you know, with just moving Lava Coil to the main deck instead of Lightning Strike. So we don't have a lot that can go upstairs. We have the Shocks. We're playing some Flame Sweeps in the main deck uh, because we don't have Chain Whirler. Um, but yeah, this this looks pretty good. The So one thing that I was really worried about is I was like, how are we going to deal with a Danto Vanguard? I was like, Red just can't... You know, like we're not going to be able to ever kill a Danto Vanguard. Vampires is, you know, one like maybe the second most popular deck right now. And so I was going through all the cards. I couldn't find anything. Going through all the cards and then multicolor. Then I then I found it. The deck. You know, we can cast for red, red, <clears throat> kill a Danto Vanguard plus three minus three. So I'm going with four bedecks in the sideboard. Even though I don't really care to bedazzle, we could just play like four. Um, Blood Crips to maybe turn on Bedazzle at sometimes, but I'm not going to bring in Bedeck Bedazzle against Field of the Dead. I don't think like with it costing six mana and everything. I'm that's I don't think I'm even going to sideboard it in there. So we're not going to go with the Blood Crips. We're just going with the basic mountains, which will uh, help us out a lot more than having to pay two life at different times. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, so we're going to have Bedeck here. Um. You know, like what I what I was doing in my Chandra Tribal deck before is I was playing Spyglasses because Spyglass, you can name Soren or Adanto Vanguard and it's you know good against control decks and everything like that. But the deck should be really good against any aggro. You know, like we'll just bring it in against like all all the aggro decks is just another removal spell. There, uh, we got War Boss against Control. Same with like our our top end. Like we can we can put in War Boss and another Chandra and an Ugin against control decks whenever we want to cut Flame Sweep and Lava Coil. Against those control decks, they're likely going to be blue or white, right? So we'll probably have some fries to be able to bring in there as well. But yeah, this, this looks pretty good. I'm excited to play it. I think Field of the Dead is going to be our hardest thing to, to beat. But besides that, I like I like what we got going on here. Um, we Yeah, Blast Zone is, is an option. Blast Zone, you can play Blast Zone instead of Mobilize District. I'm going with the District to be able to help like attack Planeswalkers and, and everything and... and uh, but districts are they're okay, um, and they can block for our planeswalkers and everything like that too. They're okay, but they're not amazing. Blast zone's also another option that you could go there. Um, it it is nice to have a lot of mountains because like we have twenty six lands because we want to hit land drops, but also having mountains you can discard to regulator. You know, so mountains you can't just discard any land. But, but yeah, blast zones are definitely an option for this kind of deck as well. Um, but yeah, let's let's get to it. Let's play some Chandra Tribal with our brand new Chandra sleeves. We got the fancy ones yesterday. Let's do it. Let's play a league. This is the deck. Yeah, this is the deck that I was the most excited to play today. But I will say that Grixis felt pretty good. You know, we did really well with Grixis. What? <clears throat> I think Nissa decks probably benefit the most from Karn's Bastion. Where Nissa deck like Nissa produces a lot of mana. It makes creatures that have uh, counters. Nissa has counters. I think Nissa is probably the the card in the format that likes Cardin's Bastion the most. All right, hoping our opponent is on control. If they're on aggro, we're gonna get run over. To, unless we draw other cards, to be honest. Hoping they're on control. This is a, a good start against control with three mana Chandra, four mana Chandra. So we want to see, like, Watery Grave. Okay, not good for us. No Lightning Strike's rotating out. So no, no Lightning Strike. Ugh, this is really bad. That's a, that's a very aggressive deck. 
Okay, well, we are pretty dead. And by pretty dead, I mean 100% dead. So I'm not going to really show my opponent anymore, to be honest. Because we have a 0% chance of winning that. Alright, so Bedeck can kill all of their 2 drops. But the bigger creatures can can be a problem. You know, like, large green creatures, especially ones that survive, like Chandra's Triumph, are going to be tough. But, yeah, Ripjaw Raptor, obviously, all we do is damage. Ripjaw Raptor, obviously, is going to be tough. Um, but, oh, well, I mean, I guess we should play Ugin also. Okay. Because Ugin can actually kill large creatures. Let's... Let's trim one Awakened Inferno for bringing in Ugin, and then I think Fire Artisan, Acolyte of Flame. I want to trim one of each of those. And I guess a Novice Pyromancer. Probably, maybe just the Flame. Actually, let's, let's just take out these Flame Sweeps. Yeah, let's take out the Flame Sweeps and maybe get back the Acolyte of Flame that can recast... Now, oh no, Acolyte of Flame does not recast Bedeck. So there's still only just the 12 cards for Acolyte of Flame. Let's, let's play Fire Artisan. Okay. Play one Flame Sweep. Yeah, Novice. Uh, yeah, this card's really good in this deck. Um... All three modes are are very useful. Flame sweep kills, like the, I'm I'm assuming they have the one to, like, you know we saw land war elf there. I'm assuming they have the one two, um, the red two drop is a one two and probably drover the mighty also. So basically, it'll just kill mana creatures. That's basically the same hand. Anyway, um. Yeah, so Novice Pyromancer has that minus two that, that's pretty decent removal. You know, like, there's a lot of Planeswalkers you want to kill with that. Let's take this out. The, the That minus one adding mana is really important with our six mana walkers. So the adding mana lets us double spell also. That's really important. And then if we have three mana Chandra, then the plus one can also do the other stuff. But this is a very important card in the deck. Hmm. No, we're, we're going to get rid of Fire Artisan. Okay. Yeah, I don't... I'm, I'm not playing the, the Ember Cat. Even though, yeah, Ember Cat can ramp for the Chandras, but... With Ember Cat being just the one, like being just like your only creature, it turns on all of your opponent's removal. And I don't, I don't want to just have like one creature in the deck that my opponent gets to use their removal spells. I'd rather removal spells be dead. Plus, we have Flame Sweeps. You know, allows us to play Flame Sweep main. Oh, that's awesome, Angry Ben. Glad you're having huge success with Sultai Treachery in Best of One. Happy to hear. Yeah, so they have this. So we, they have that thing that. Flame Sweep would have killed. Like, this is a pretty nice combo, too. Like, this adding mana is really nice. You know, you can play Chandra minus, add two mana, play the Triumph, deal five damage, or, you know, play any of these two mana spells. Extra mana, very good. Ready? 
I'm ready. Let's do that. Here, have some of that magic stuff. What's that smell? Oh, it's you burning. So perfect. We can play the Awakened Inferno next turn. to meet my flames. Glad I could help it's really you unfortunate they had a 7-6. I had to use the entire Chandra just to kill. These creatures are a little, little too big for us. <laughs> yeah. We have to have our 6 drop kill the... Kill that. Okay. Now that's a... Into that ley line. Better six drop for us to draw. I came into long Probably our best possible card to draw. Truth lies beyond vision. Another Riptar Raptor. Yuck. Which is so tough for us. I said earlier that I thought Field of the Dead may be our toughest thing. I think. I think Jun Dinosaurs may be our toughest matchup. I forgot about this deck. But our. Our deck is is doing some cool stuff though. Kill one raptor. No, next set's not medieval theme, it's it's like fairy tale theme. No, there will not be check lands in Throne of Eldraine. Uh, there, there will be rare dual lands, but we don't know. We just, we don't know what they will be. I mean, I guess it's possible they're check lands, but I think that's a. It's, it's like a very, very, very small chance for that to be the case. Can our opponent just draw some lands? Want them to hit some land drops. You have aired. Okay. That's just dead. Seek 
secrets manifest before you. <clears throat> so Triumph does get to kill Raptor. I think I need to full control this. I guess I would have been able to respond to that, but I, I want to kill this. I wanted to kill this thing, or I wanted to shoot this after damage, but not before damage. I didn't want to just shock it, and then they kill my 2-2, and then I don't get anything. Five cards in hand. Must have been a bunch of green spells. Because they were just using the unclaimed territories for green mana. For the dinos. Yeah, so Novice Pyromancer was awesome there. Awaken I think we can go with Awakened Inferno over Fire Artisan. Let's get another one of those in here. But as we saw there... Yeah, Ugin was amazing. As we saw there, the, some of their creatures are really hard for me to deal with. Like Rotting Regisaur and uh, Ripjaw Raptor. We got really lucky with that game. Yeah, they could have been sitting... That's true, because we just played Mountain Mountain game one, so they could have thought that we were like Mono Red Aggro and we're sitting on a bunch of removal. That is... Very possible. If I would if I was able to just keep hitting land drops, I may have just triumphed that land war. But I was not guaranteed to keep hitting land drops. So there's twenty six lands in the deck. Do we risk I mean, we could just coil the Ceratops, or do we risk it and activate this? I think we risk it. Ugh. Like, we're not going to win if we don't hit land drops, I don't think. No accord. No peace. What's that? Something smells rotten. Wait, that might be me. Hmm. I don't know if I can risk it again. Oh, come on. We have 26 lands in the deck. Ugh. I mean, that's the thing is, I, I can't just only have two lands, I don't think. Like, I don't think I'm going to win this with just two lands. Uh, you just take anything. Yeah, that's 
Yeah, that's that's basically what I was doing. I was playing I was playing to win and not to not lose. Oh, I wish you could see your face while I'm beating you. Correct. So there's 24 lands left in the deck. And, you know, only and only like 50 cards instead of 60 cards. I mean, I guess that last time it was actually down to, what, uh, 47 whenever we drew that last one. So we had two games that we didn't really get to play. We had two, you know, two games that we didn't put up any fight. Um, but we had a game where we did get to play, and our deck looked pretty good in that game. We found all the lands that we needed last game, though. <laughs> I've lost so much already. I won't lose more. Strike now! Strike hard! Thanks, Deck. Does seem like there's something with the two land and five land. Like those magic numbers. When you keep two land, you don't draw lands. When you keep five lands, you draw lands. Like your first two draws. When you have five lands, the first two are always land land. When you have two lands, the first two are All always spell spell. And end in nature. Don't have Frilled Mystic up. Let's okay. Do this again. It did not flash in a creature either there. Alright, time to regulate these draw steps. Regulating them draw steps. I think I need to pay the one here. Just do the one card. Back and watch it burn. Um, what else did I do? Crixis. Cards are off. We will not fail. Be wary of the ground you walk on. So we need to find and then we're Chandra's triumphs. All right, that'll work. Now you've done it. Do not underestimate my fortitude. Uh, 
Okay. So we have six mana here. If I activate Mobilize District, cost two. Hmm. So if I play Chandra, that's four. The two mana there. Okay, so I can't do Regulator. Let's just see if this is land. So I, I cannot do this. So decline. Let's load it up. Cool. Oh, I need I need one more mana. All right. Well, I guess. Be afraid, wizard. I hope I sounded tough. All right. Well, I guess. All right. Never mind. I was kind of planning on the minus two part. I guess I could have just minus two, and just killed Nissa. But I want to kill this land and everything too. All right. Let's add some mana. I'm getting the hang of this magic thing. Here, have some of that magic stuff. Mm, this isn't going to work. This isn't going to work either. Oh, I guess that's a thing. Yeah, whatever I meant to do, I did not I did not do it. <laughs> whatever I meant to do, I did not do it. All right, well that was really bad. Saved. I cannot protect you. It's just going to be bad for you. Okay. Well, yeah, I messed that whole turn up, but I think I should have just minus two'd with the novice pyromancer, just minus minus two that twice and kill Nissa with that and then have the district be able to block for the island. We're done here. Yeah, I don't I don't know what's going on with our bone stack. Protect the virtue of this world. Oh, thanks, Harvey. Rise, my elemental friend. Hmm. Thanks, Atriant. Time for sparks to fly. Okay, so reach into that ley line thing. Up here. Ooh, exploded. So of course these are these lands are elementals. We can't do like the normal minus three to get rid of them. Eight seven. Nissa, why are you so good? Harness the elements. Okay, jeez, enough.
not test me. Glad I could help with your not being on fire problem. All right, well, we got that 8-7 out of here. So they still have an island. But we got Regulator. But Nyssa and the 8-7 are gone. Island should kill the novice Pyromancer, unfortunately. Um, yeah, with... Okay, so the question is, what would you... Um, purchase with 3000 gems packs or events if you if you like playing sealed like that's that's what i would be doing with the 3400 gems i would i would be playing sealed yeah i should have oh yeah i should have done that i should have minus one chandra i guess i just i didn't really realize the minus one would kill that thing I was already thinking about having to do, like, the, you know, considering about, like, with the blocking. And my opponent not blocking kind of threw me for a loop a little bit. Um, but, yeah. Yeah, y'all are right. I should have minus one. I know, I know. As I far as I know, the Gargos ability is a May ability. Sit back and watch it burn. Let's light it up! to fight something. Oh, stop. Oh, it's fights up to one, so it's kind of like a May ability. These green creatures are so big. Gonna be bad for you. Why are we gonna keep getting paired against like these seven toughness and everything? Yeah, the dive down Hydra deck. Yep. Yeah, the dive down makes sense for the Gargos to fight stuff. This is two really unfortunate pairings for us, just huge green creatures. This is not not good. Like Nyssa. Really difficult. I tried so hard fighting through like multiple Nissas and Gargos and all that, but there's just more of them. Hmm. There's not red removal that gets rid of eight sevens. Hopefully there's like a, a three damage sweeper that actually kills Nissa lands. Since Chandra doesn't. Hopefully that's a thing in Throne of Eldraine. Yeah, we need Star of Extinction. I'm kidding. But of course, that kills our poor little Chandra's, though, too. Alright, so Novice Pyromancer can ramp us into Ugin. We'll 
the reason why people are fixed on Simic with Gorg with Gargos is because of Hydrocrasis. If you're gonna play Gargos, you're gonna want Hydrocrasis. So you need to be Simic. I can certainly play Bant though. Yeah, basically I want yeah, we need Clarion in just get rid of the mountain. We need Clarion in just red. Please don't have Nissa. I really can't beat Nissa. Please don't. Don't have turn three Nissa. Thing has too much loyalty. Truly spectacular. At least it's not Nissa. Should be untapping Paradise Druid. Give it hexproof again. One drop yep. ripples and grows. I'm ready to fight. Sure. Well, guess I'm not the only one with a temper. Hmm. I'm getting the hang of this magic thing. Ooh, hot, 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 hot. into that ley line here have some of that magic stuff when you understand the reality I your past is unwritten all right we'll have the regulator discard this other regulator here Rough league for us. I love to make a Dinosaurs and Hydras. You know, dinosaur tribal and Hydra tribal. Oh, I just wasted that mana. Now I'm salty. Okay, well we're still in it. What? My hair is on fire? <laughs> I know. Okay, no so just see if we hit a land drop. This is just gonna be bad for you. We'll take it.
Okay. We're actually doing doing stuff. Oh yeah, regulator. Pretty awesome. We've seen novice pyromancer. How good that card's been for us too. Oh no. Blast zone. Gets to go on four. That's bad for us. Do I discard a lava coil to draw a card? Probably not. Right? Just keep coil. I'll cycle it. <laughs> yeah, I need Teferi's regulator. Yuck. Alright, now we talking. Oh, this isn't going to work. Alright, well, this is just a waste doing those. Alright, well, that, that was a waste. I forgot I need mana for the regulator here. Say hi to my fiery friends. Because I think this one shots them, right? Yeah, one shot. The regulator, Chandra, Acolyte of Flame, Chandra Novice, Pyromancer. Combo, just one shot, does 20. Okay, okay. We get to play another game. <laughs> yeah, that, that one shot always comes out of nowhere. Keep. Yeah, we've, I mean, we've had two really good games here with this deck. Um, the other three we've kind of gotten ran over, but I mean, even that that first loss that was a good game. That first loss in this one, both all, both games in this match have definitely been good. This has been a good match. Thankfully, we have this regulator. Get rid of some extra mountains. Am I supposed to just kill the Chandra or kill that Lanwar off there? Maybe I was. I don't know, these Chandra Triumphs are just so valuable. Being able to do five damage. Like they're our, our best burn spell. What's up, Dennis? Let's regulate this Chandra. There's no problem. Fire can't solve. Get some more lands out of, out of here. Sit back and watch it burn. There we go. 
That was a good burn spell to draw. All right, we've gone through 12 lands so far. That's pretty good. Oh no. Dive down. Hmm. Dive down kind of rough, but not too bad. I'm going to wait on Awaken Inferno. I'm not going to tap out here. What's that smell? Oh, this is just going to be bad for you. Magic stuff. Huh. I'm getting the hang of this magic thing. This worked out well. Glad my opponent didn't dive down while I was tapped out. There's no problem. Fire can't solve. That worked out quite well. That was the plan, yep. Coil plus triumph dive down, but also just play Chandra. Of course, they could have died down while I was tapped out, and then I would have been sad. Ugh. It's too, too large. All right. Let's, I mean, we can kill that thing with the Awakened Inferno, though. Like, we're doing just fine here. I guess they could have another dive down, though. Sit back and watch it burn. Sparks to fly. Okay, so reach into that ley line thing. Since that thing's going away, I'm just gonna play it. In a thousand lifetimes. Hopefully, no dive down. Rude. Well, they can't kill Fire Artisan with a 6-7. Yeah, same thing. I would have had to minus X to kill Hydra. I mean, whether I'd kill Hydra, you know, try that with Awakened Inferno or try that with Ugin. Either way, the dive down would have saved it. Yeah, I, I understand. I understand I could have killed with, with that, but... This Chandra ticked up and found the Ugin. The Ugin would have just gone away if we didn't do that. I didn't want the Ugin just to go away for nothing. Truth lies beyond vision. Hmm. Minus seven Chandra or nah? Let's go nah. gonna be bad for you there's no problem fire can't solve if I play this Chandra then sacrifice it does it do four damage I feel like it would no that's lame I feel like it should Magic stuff. All right, reset some loyalty. You need to be free. I'm getting the hang of this magic. 
magic thing. Time for sparks to fly. Stay back. I'm an explosively good pyromancer. Man, this deck is cool. Ugh, stop it with the dive downs. I might as well just say, might as well decline. It's already hard enough for me to kill big creatures, but then killing big creatures through dive downs, through triple dive down, makes it more problematic. Uh, nah, we don't need to block. Ow. I mean, if they don't have, an, I mean, we can still kill this Hydra if they don't have more dive downs. Wait, does this do seven damage to them twice? Yeah, only once. Uh, I kind of don't think I just mill over. I just decline, right? Like we can't play fourteen cards in a turn. Oh, it's you burning. All right, we'll do the we'll one shot. Chandra, you need more control. Just let me burn. There we go, Chandra Tribal. Take out the big hydras. This deck could do so much cool stuff. Best card in the, like MVP of the, the deck for sure is the the uncommon Chandra Chandra Novice Pyromancer. It just gives us so much mana. Well, that, obviously, Regulator. Like, those two, that combination gives us so much mana to be able to cast all this stuff. <clears throat> Chandra Furia. Yeah, I guess it, it's probably Regulator. Yeah, I played... We played one rotation-proof Gruul deck. Like a Gruul Ilharg deck. I think during our very first rotation proof day. That is true. Without without regulator, we would have lost with all the lands we drew. Last game. Hero. Hero, precinct one. How are you doing today? Rid of my regulator. I'm happy as a hellion to start some fire. Don't worry. I brought company. Regulate this, Teferi. Boom. I really should have seen that coming. No, we would need it. I don't yeah, it could have been I guess it could have been turn. I don't know, could have been lethal ish. I don't know exactly what turn it would have been. 
All right. Anyway, let's let's play this thing. Let's get this in play. So many new worlds. So many, okay. Add some mana. Recast this coil. Fight fire with fire. Keep the triumph because triumph can kill Teferi. Rude. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Could have gone regular and play. Oh my gosh! Oh, they're not dead. They're at twenty-two. But they're, like, basically dead. They just let me have Regulator? Get him, Are you buddy. kidding me? Hey, How do you just let me have Regulator? Guys are great. What are you doing over there? It's Elemental, dear. What's your name? Let's get stoked. Yeah, let's get stoked. <laughs> Opponent did not see that coming. They did not know that I could just play that card in my hand that they did not thought erasure and do 20 damage to them. Okay. Let's see. Let's get rid of the flame sweepers. I kind of want to go war boss. But I don't want to like I guess they're, you know, they're hero, so they're going with a good amount of creatures. So I don't want to just get rid of like all my removal. Oh, uh, we got awakened inferno and stuff too. So we're good. We can get rid of a coil. Play these. Obviously, we're playing the Fries. Fry is just upgraded Shock and Coil. So what if we do this? Keep three Shock. I think I like keeping Shock. I mean, I guess I should pro maybe play these things instead of Shock. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of like Shock here. Yeah, I think I think I'm fine right here. Let's try that. If they were not hero, they're more control, I'd be putting in the six mana planeswalkers instead of having the shocks. If they were Esper control for their hero. Good news, we drew Regulator. Bad news, we drew it right before Thought Erasure. No Thought Erasure. Oh, I thought they were going to go like second main Thought Erasure. Wow, that's a... That's a move right there. Maybe whenever we play Esper Control next, maybe I should do that. Play land, be like, oh, no Thought Erasure. Start passing the turn, and then be like, boom, second main Thought Erasure. That's a move right there. Get fried. Do you want fries with that, deputy? Hmm. I guess like Acolyte of Flame. Is like my worst card in hand. I think we just keep the, this hand. You want to play with fire, huh? Sit back 
and watch it burn. Oh no, whatever will I do without that mountain? Good thing we have a mountain of lands in this deck. And we can go without that one. If you show remorse, I'll show restraint. Keep up the pace. No, playing it second main doesn't do anything like playing first main. It just gets your opponent it gets your opponent's hopes up that you don't actually have it. Thanks now for playing your Teferi for first hey, before attacking. Was uncalled for. Appreciate it. Wow, that's a draw. That's a good draw. All right, wait, how much mana do I need? So let's see. Oh, no, so Chandra, so she costs one mana. Uh, so I have five. I play Chandra. I have four. I can still play Fry. Hmm. Or could just minus two Chandra and just kill Teferi with the Chandra. But Chandra could get countered. Hmm. I guess we'll just do this. I'm just kind of plan on frying Teferi, I guess. Let's light it up. There's no problem. Fire can't solve. Play two mana. We will meet again. Looks like Teferi needed a side of fries also. Ooh, yeah, yeah, Elder Spell could definitely be rough. No denial there. Well, if they play average at best Guard Mage again, then we know they don't have counter magic and no counter magic there. All right, so we're free to we're free to play stuff. We could attack for twenty. Just want to attack for twenty? No, we can't. We can't. Okay, never mind. We don't have enough mana. Never mind. Never mind. All right, let's start with you, and. Yes. Sit back and watch it burn. What's that smell? Mm. Oh, it's you burning. I don't know what I'm doing here, but it's going to be fun. Ooh, hot, 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 hot! Okay, so reach into that ley line thing. Definitely hoping no older spell. Anyone need a fire started? No? Too bad. I can just study? Focus? I just want to burn stuff already. As long as there's no Elder Spell over there, I really like our chances of winning this. That's basically like the only card that I'm scared of right now. No! So I'm going home. Uh. Hmm. Let's start at a sizzle and see if you make it to the inferno. Hope it's not too <laughs> No 
pressure. <laughs> Well, they're not Esper Control, really, they're Esper Hero. It's possible they didn't have Elder Spell. This isn't a fight you can win. Time is much more malleable than people think. Wow. Rough. Ready to fight. <laughs> Toast it. You yeah, yeah. Okay, hold on. I'm going to try something new. All right, I got punished for not doing the minus 3. I thought I could I thought I could do the minus 3 again the next turn. Maybe maybe they play like another creature or two with us having the backup Chandra. If I didn't have the backup Chandra in hand, I would have minus 3. Yeah. They're they're not Esper Control. Sorry, I'm late. They're Esper Hero. These are all cards of Esper Hero. They had they just had an Elder Spell on the sideboard. That's more like it. Cool, Baloney Pony. Yeah, I'm sure we'll play that deck some more. Glad glad you like that deck. Oh, that's it. I'm going home. We want to draw a mountain here. Darn. All right, so I know not to overextend into Elder Spell the next time. They do have it. And also to clear out. So, like, there's two two decisions that, you know, like that turn, and then I should have just minus three this other Chandra right away. I was, I was hoping I could snag another hero and everything. Game's not over. I'll protect you. We got another big Chandra in here. We could draw. I needed that last turn. All right, so yeah, they're you know obviously um, have they have tons of discard spells. We saw multiple duresses to go with all the thought erasures. So I think that we need to be able to top deck well, and top decking shocks is not top decking well. So I'm getting more six mana planeswalkers in here. Um, do I want flame sweep instead of this other shock? No. All right, game number three. Awesome, Iggy Boo. Glad you're liking the Sultai Treachery deck from yesterday. Glad it's working out for you. Which one of these four mana Chandras do we want to put back? I'm definitely keeping three land regulator war boss. Kind of like this one as removal. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think I like novice as re both removal and the thing about novice is, you know, like we draw the six mana planeswalkers, novice gets to ca to cast them with that minus ability. Bunch of new burn spells to try on you. I can't believe find your fires of passion. I could do four damage to them, but it's I think it's better to be able to like minus and you know have the Chandra have more loyalty and everything. Mind and body should move. I have just the trick for this. If we draw two lands next turn. Hey Kodiak, welcome. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Say hi to my fiery friends. Let's get stoked. I still have much to So learn. worst case scenario, of course, is Elder Spell again. Please no Elder Spell. Oh, come on. They have it. That's so rough. So then they can Elder Spell plus Thought Erasure. Or they're just reading them. But... Ooh, maybe they were just reading them. Trust me, you'll thank me later. No time for a break. Hmm. Do we just go for lethal? Yeah, I mean, we obviously do. We can activate this mobilized district. That was about all they could have to not die there, because like a single removal spell would not have saved them with us having the mobilized district also. So they they kind of needed that instant speed planeswalker removal after I started activating Chandra.
I'm telling Mother Ludi on you. I never. I don't think I've heard that line. So their plan is just to cast the Outer Azure anyway, with me having the one card in hand. I think they should just go with that and then just keep the duress. Um. We can do study. Focus. Basically, I don't want I don't want Chandra to die to another Oath of Kaya. So instead of doing four damage to them, I'm getting two counters on it, so it doesn't die to another Oath of Kaya. So basically seeing if, if Chandra hit a land, we, we would be able to pay the extra one and do two damage to them. Alright, even fought through Elder Spell. Or no, they didn't have Elder Spell. Never mind, but still. Chandra Tribal! Two and one. Oh, I didn't put... Grixis control up. Or Grixis midrange. I didn't finish uploading that to YouTube. Whoops. Alright, publish now. Well, that could have been on probably like half hour, hour ago. Whoops. Alright, it's on now. Caesar, I'm sure that was a mistake. That was a misclick. I oh, that's right. I know there is alt art regulator. I don't remember what it looks like. It's not on arena. But now that you mention it, I remember that being a thing and seeing it somewhere. Um, but I, I don't remember exactly what it looks like. Anyone need a match? No. Too bad. Can't believe Mother Ludi gave us homework. That card's cool. Ooh, you must be mad to tussle with me. <laughs> Things are about to get real rowdy. I, I'm ready to fight. Hey, these little guys are great. It's, let's get stoked. We will rise again. Yeah, so yeah, that other regular, yeah, that art's pretty good. I know, poor Domri. No more Domri. It's a nickel bolus. Make it a 4 4. Yeah, don't attack. All right, don't attack my Chandras. Now. I'm getting all fired up. Hmm.
just gonna Let's I know I could like up. do some other stuff with these, but I'm just gonna kill that. Kill that. Whoosh, up in flames. Fire's Our loyalty counter back. With help. Hold up triumph. For something. <laughs> Alright, Caesar. Next up battle, if we get this one, you can requ you can request a respin. Hey, J Rock. Good evening. Yeah, Chandra does really have amazing synergy with Chandra. I agree. My opponent's like, what am I supposed to do? There's too many Chandras over there. Because the, mo I don't know, mobilized districts just do some good work. They, they do some attacking and stuff. They can block. I don't know. Combat's cool. Hmm. I just want to use this because I want to add mana with this Chandra this next turn. Oh, I guess we don't need to add mana. Anyone who stands in my way is getting sizzled. It's not too hot for getting sizzled. So I was gonna just, you know, swing for six with the elementals. So green, red, another deck that could be tough. What we're doing before is taking out one Chandra three and bringing in an Ugin in this matchup. And I think I like that. Um, yeah. We'll see. We'll see if we see more of their deck. Maybe I want the Bedex, potentially. Well, Field of Ruin is rotating out. But um, then, you know, our deck's rotation proof, so Field of Ruin's not an option for us. But still, even in wise up. Yeah, maybe that's better than Mobilized District. I don't know. That'd be close. That'd be close which one to play. Um, maybe it is just play the four Field of Ruins in the deck, though, instead of Mobilized Districts. Hmm. Yeah, district has been pretty good for us. Uh, we haven't placed, we haven't played against Field of the Dead though. I think we're going to struggle against Field of the Dead with, since we don't have Blood Suns. But Field of Ruin would be able to help there. Yeah, district. Yeah, I mean, I, I like the, the mobile districts. I liked them. I, I'm not really looking to replace them. So best case scenario there is I pass the turn, they activate on their turn, and then uh, I Chandra's Triumph in response. However, what a better player would do, like myself, I would I would just play my third land like this and pass, and I wouldn't activate. And then at that point, we just wasted 
that mana because then we can't we can't like end step shoot the crab warrior because then they'll just uh, activate afterwards. Yeah, I really like these mobilized districts. This city is so constraining. I need to be free. I call my fists Pyromaster and Fire. These two cards have just been amazing for us. Regulator and Novice Pyromancer. Here, have some of that magic. Stuck. Time for sparks to fly. Let's make this quick. I've got other things to burn. Oh, let's get toasty. So I'm just going to go double emblem. It does mean they can attack Novice Pyromancer and kill Novice Pyromancer. But we already have double emblem and then we're about to get like double emblem again. And we'll d discard this mountain to the regulator. Annoying. Well, my spirit's been doused. Hmm. Back and watch it burn. Hope it's not too <laughs> no pressure. <laughs> I could have gone one emblem and then it and attacked with mobilized district here. Like attack because it has vigilance and then triumph. But then we only do one emblem. I'll just get the second emblem. <laughs> this is an emblematic victory. <laughs> Man, this deck's fun. I'm really glad we've gone to four Novi Chandra Novice Pyromancer. That card's just been an all-star. Go Rakdos, Chandra Tribal, with some black removal spells, and then Angrath. I do like me some Angrath. There are a lot of good black removal spells and discard. And discard works really well with three mana Chandra, being able to recast it also. No, I, don't, I don't think this deck needs Karn's Bastion. I don't think there's really ever been a time where I wish I had Karn's Bastion. That costs too much mana to activate. Just to add like one counter. All right, well we got our two best cards. Regulator, Novice Pyromancer. So this is a turn five kill through no disruption. Boo. Take the mountain. Take the mountain. Take the mountain. You can't overcome a mountain. You know how hard it is to climb a mountain? Gotta take the mountain. Wow, didn't take the mountain. So I could wait a turn here on Regulator. Because they probably have Bedevil for it. Or Rampage. Okay, good. I'm glad we didn't wait the turn. The thing is, like, if we wait a turn, that's bad against Thought Erasure, but if we play it right away, it's bad against Bedevil or Rampage. And because of Discard, we don't need to change our hand right now. There's not any two-mana card that we can draw. 
that we can play anyway. We'll do it end step. I think I'm a decent enough pyromancer. Hmm. I want to cycle through a mountain? Not really. Could minus add two mana and then cycle through this mountain. <clears throat> ah, well, we would have been able to cycle through a regulator. I didn't want to cycle through the regula the backup Listen, regulator though, because if they had Bedevil for the first one, obviously we're going we're going to now. We'll get rid of the third regulator. I don't know how Grixis beats double Chandra emblem. All right, answer is they can't. Yeah, Regulator is an artifact. So Grixis has pretty decent removal for Regulator between uh, Bedevil and Grass Rampage, that kind of stuff. All right, we're going to kind of assume Grixis control since we didn't see them play other stuff. I think I'm going to keep some Shocks in, though. Shock and kill Warboss or... Thief of Sanity, which I guess we need to be kind of worried about those two. Three Shock, two Fry. But I guess Novice Pyromancer does as well, though. And so does Awakened Inferno. And like basically everything else in our deck, Chandra's Triumphs do as well. All right, we can get another Fry in here. Three and two. All right, looks good. Because, yeah, Fry takes out the Bolases. Shock can still do something. You do things. And stuff. We don't really have other great cards to bring in. Just, you know, could play the fourth fry. Shock can kill planeswalkers that minus. If they have, like, Sarkin and they Minus or Ugin. Or you never know. Maybe they'll have Knight of the Ebon Legion or Dreadhorde Butcher. You never know. Zari says, wow, this deck looks like seems like so much fun. It's awesome to watch, though. I don't think it's good for me to watch this. I feel a sudden urge to go craft this deck myself with my last of wild cards. Yeah, this I mean I, I think this is a lot of fun. This deck's a lot of fun to play. Um No, it's not the best deck in the format, but the Chandras get to do so many like there's so so many options to do with all these planeswalkers and with regulator and it's fun. Just remember, this minus one add two mana is incredible. Big part of that card. Yeah, the mana base is real cheap. At least these are uncommons also. As far as planeswalkers go. Well, that's unfortunate that they got to surveil over a disfigure. I wish they would have to draw a disfigure. Alright, 
There goes one of the Chandras. I don't know, maybe they were expecting War Boss from the sideboard for the disfigure. And War Boss is a pretty common sideboard card. Maybe that's why. Next for me. All right, we'll go get a mobilized district. Yeah, it'd be really nice to have a regulator. You could already almost flip as Kanta. We're already a, a, a land heavy deck with having 56 lands, or sorry, with having 26 lands. But now we're like a 56 land deck, or 56 card deck with these gone with 26 lands. So I'm pretty worried about us flooding. The best news so far from this game is my opponent only has one black source. So we really don't have to be worried about Nicol Bolas Dragon God soon. With just one black source. I've learned a bunch of new burn spells to try on you. Say hi to my fiery friends. Yeah, <laughs> fifty-six lands. Reasonable. What do you think, Hawkeye? You play fifty-six land deck? They're playing a lot of cards, but haven't really gotten anywhere. Just let them, like, we both have five lands. We both have three cards in hand. We have a Planeswalker. And we have this Mobilized District. All right, don't have the Planeswalker anymore. I should attack with Mobilized District there. That should be attack. I just kind of hit the pass turn and then was like, wait, I'm supposed to attack. I'm happy as a hellion to start we'll see fire. if that's, you know, how much that three points matters. Friends. Good good chance it does with, you know, having these shocks in hand. But, you know, like they were tapped out. We could have got three in. Okay, I really likes the ear scratches. I don't know if y'all can hear him. He's purring pretty loudly. So. Every exploit ripples through the fabric of the multiverse obeys me. Sagas with brought back for Throwback Thursday. Yeah, I remember the Crucible of Worlds. I wrote that one down. I could see what I could do with the Sagas with brought back. They go back into play. I'll write down the idea. We'll see.
Yeah, now they can bedevil. They got they got the two black. Secrets manifest before you. Be afraid, wizard. Here, have some of that magic stuff. They just had nothing to do that turn. Uh, so many basics. I am the master here. A little death never hurt anyone. That's just nine. Yeah. Because I get to shock again to put him to five. This Chandra puts him down to three. The mobilized district kills him. All right, we're four and one with Chandra Tribal. Let's get those final boss emotes in the chat. I think that's why we beat the final boss last time, because we had so many final boss emotes. Here we go, final boss playlist. Yeah, probably not getting that, that August Top 1000 email today with it being a holiday. Well, it's also just really late anyway in the day. It's late at night, but I wouldn't have expected that today. Let's see. Yeah. Kind of want to just keep the fourth land and put the Flame Sweep back. Put a Flame Sweep back. Yeah, we could have kept our duress proof hand. That seven lane hand would have been really good against our previous Grixis opponent. All right, now definitely regretting keeping flame sweep. After drawing the third. You'd snap keep the seven lander. Kefnet's really tough. Kefnet's really tough. I guess we got a bunch of fries to go with the triumphs. I don't think it's Hero with them playing Kefnet. I don't think Kefnet and Hero go in the same deck. Yeah, they they probably play they probably drew that Thought Erasure on turn four, the turn that they played Kefnet. That's probably the turn they drew Thought Erasure and played Kefnet first. And then yeah, they didn't reveal it. Because yeah, they, then they didn't draw it the next turn and then just played it. Afterwards, <sighs> won't lie. I'm a pretty great, don't worry. 
Really want to draw this land to get Fire Artisan in play that will help help us hit land drops. I don't have enough swears right now. All right, I'm gonna lead with Acolyte of Flame though. First, there's more removal. I'd rather them kill Acolyte of Flame here. Plus, we can't hit an extra land drop this next turn. Where if we we play Chandra next turn, we could play the land immediately. Oh, so cute. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. As per control with. With Kefnet. No problem. Fire can't solve. Yep, that's what I'm thinking too. I would, yeah, Ollie. I would risk it with some basics. Also, I would, I would do um, a good amount of tap lands, but then also some basics as well. Maybe you know, like like two basics of each color or so. Probably not too much more than that. I don't know however many tap lands there are yes so risk it with both okay let's see do we think they will have I guess I should play around elder spell We could ultimate this up this Chandra next turn. All right, we're going to game three against Esper. Ugh. Final boss, game three. They sided in for Elder Spell. No. Not for Elder Spell. Uh, second time, we drew Regulator, which is a great draw, but we drew it right before Thought Erasure, which is not good. Ooh, no Thought Erasure, though. Alright, Ascanta. Ascanta's a good card.
Just keep it on top. So bad news, they keep on keeping spells they, they like. Good news is that means Ascanta doesn't flip as fast. I'm known for my excellent timing. Goes nothing. That's rude. At least they just have one card. I'm getting rid of one of these here. I'm not sure which one. And we keep on playing against these decks that really like their discard spells. Our last opponent played like three discard spells and Unmoored Ego. This one's already at... We're at three discard spells so far. Four mana Chandra. Mm. Do we activate Mobilize District? We didn't have the mana before to attack. We now do. It costs four mana to activate. Okay. That's a trade I am willing to make. A card that could have exiled a planeswalker. Boo. All right, so Kefnet being back in there means that they're probably not activating as Kanta for the next two turns. So that's good. Or they are. All right, Kefnet gone for good. They got Big Teferi and Little Teferi, and I have Ugin. 
Little Chandra. There's a whole lot of good stuff to get with this command, the Dread Horde. Uh, hopefully, the the double emblem helps out though. Going down to six. I know my responsibility against double emblem. They don't. This doesn't deal with mobilized district either, does it? Oh, I guess they get to untap two lands. Cause they're yeah, they're not gonna tuck. This is risky. I brought company. This is pretty aggressive. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Only a matter of There's time. No problem. Fire can't solve. Yeah, maybe I don't know if like little Chandra, if I should be going after like little Chandra doesn't you know can kill the novice pyromancer. I don't really mind Ugin right now. Like Ugin just you know tick up makes a two two. I feel like Teferi getting them the extra mana. Also, like, tucking he regulator. Serves me. No, 26 really isn't too many lands. Because you really have to hit land drops with this deck, but you have the regulator. Okay, I guess I didn't really consider that. But I guess they, they would have been able to Chandra make a creature... Either way to Stand enter the God watch. Eternals. I've got time. Go get him, buddies. Yikes! I'm out of here. That should be game. I don't know what I'm doing here, but it's gonna be fun. Sure hope you can't handle yeah, instant speed life gain. They could have activated as Kanta and found Vras's Contempt. If they had if they had another Vras's Contempt. We saw one. Not sure if they had another. And there we go. Five and one. Chandra Tribal. Honestly felt really good. Uh you know, we went to game three against the John Dinos. We you know we we took it to game three there and we lost because like their creatures are so big and everything, but then we took it to game three and won against the the Hydra tribal with huge creatures. We were able to deal with big creatures pretty well. Um, yeah, this deck, this deck really felt real. If you're going to play this and not rotation proof, I think the, the main thing that I'd want to change is having blood suns in the sideboard for field. Like we did not face field of the dead. Um, that's something we, you definitely want. You'd want blood suns in the sideboard and like, you don't, you probably don't need four fry 
four but deck four war boss kind of thing like that's that's where you could find them and then you know maybe playing chain whirler main instead of flame sweep but honestly just not having not having creatures felt pretty good maybe this deck doesn't really need chain whirler um yeah and <laughs> now we now we play esper control for rotation proof monday up next but yeah i was really excited to play this deck and it did not let down this was a lot of fun um I just have to say again, Regulator and Novice Pyromancer, these two cards were incredible. This is maybe the most underrated card in Standard. This card's so good. Same with this one. But at like adding that extra mana, we just that's basically what we did the whole time was just that minus one add mana. And we got to play, you know, like these six drops early and we got to double spell and do so much stuff. And then of course with Regulator, we were adding like three mana with Regulator. And yeah, it was just really good. This deck's awesome, and it's a lot of fun to play, too. So that's Chandra Tribal. So if you're watching on YouTube, definitely hit the like and subscribe buttons over there, especially that like button, because this deck was really cool. Um, uh, but if you like the Rotation Proof decks, make sure you check out the playlist over there on YouTube. I guess I can put the link here in chat, the YouTube link. It's just youtube.com slash Um But you can... Uh, uh, check out the Rotation Proof playlist for, for all the other Rotation Proof decks we've been playing over the last month or so. And check out that Grixis midrange we had before this. That deck was really good, too. But thanks for watching Shonda Tribal, and I'll see you for the next video.